Thomas gets a streak screen from Days. And then takes it from deep. He's made for March. Just making it difficult to even get started on your offensive possession. LSU's going to work it over to the wing. Head fake, step inside, shot high up, and it's in. Got it from the corner. And that's a guy that I think has a really bright future, Desmond Polk. And just like him, has been tremendous. Three three-pointers for Polk now. Four assists to go along with ten points for Cam Williams. LSU respond tremendously. Point blank range. It won't go for Watford. Gets his own rebound. Kicks out a drive and a floater. Big fella. The six foot ten forward slash center showing off the hops. Kind of an awkward catch as it. Sayui at the bottom of the screen thinking, what the heck is that? Well, it's a team that's got the LSU Tigers within two right now. And the OVC squad is able to turn much into points though. Just ten points off turnovers for SIUE. Wow! So James chucks it towards the basket. He had Pepple down there who had Watford all over his back. Watford a drive. Wide open for Thomas. The game a little bit. Watford trying to get the scoring going. It's most likely going to be him or Thomas. And there it is. Cameron Thomas by 10. And Cameron Thomas, who had 27 in his debut two days ago, has the rock and wants to go to work. He steps inside a bit here. As we go under the 14-20 mark in the second half. Watford starts a drive, kicks back out. Thomas under Jimerson. Early in this game, the offensive rebounding had been dominated by St. Louis, but LSU slowly working their way back into the mix on the offensive side. Thomas again just drives. Wilkinson wants to feed to Days. There's the defense that causes trouble. LSU recovers, throws up a tray. First of all, the bottom of the net. Two more for Javante Perkins. The strength from Javante Perkins to keep that ball in his grasp. He's got 20 today. Wow, Cameron Tom. Man, this game's slipping away from me. Get a little bit tight. Demarius Jacobs, the junior, with a huge bucket. Cameron Thomas, can they slow him down? Not this time. He gets Perkins to the opener. Watford, hot potato, back and forth with Thomas. Mismatch, Linson jumps out, and Lewis Billikins, they will not back down from the challenge. Gibson Jimerson the answer. Six point, Bills lead, make it three. Out to the wing, the Billikins give it up, and Collins nearly takes it right back. Hands by Watford, causes the steal. Thomas using that body. What is he doing? Nobody has scored. We've played a minute and a half. In Baton Rouge tonight. Long triple. Up. A deep three. Rattles out. Javante Smart tried it from distance. Tigers will have another opportunity. This for three. Yes. He played at Odessa College and Bryant University before finding his way to Hammond. Watford wanted to shoot a three. He passed the score. Kobe Williams misses that shot for Louisiana Tech. Back the other way. Comes Cam Thomas. He knows they've got to do it on the defensive end. Offensively, they're going to score a lot of points. A little step back is good. Offensive rebound. He's the one who started the break that allowed for the easy bucket on the other end. Cam Thomas inside. Three for O'Neal back on the floor for LSU. Gives Will Wade opportunity to play guys more minutes than uh, Coach Hinton talked to us yesterday. He said that he felt like his team, even though they had been playing against uh, opponents that weren't quite a 44% from the floor. This one for Sam Houston Tate. Thomas for three. Took that time. Jim Thomas. Tough angle. Got it. Throws. Thrown right to LSU. Tigers three on one. Lob. Finish. Can't let it. And I think he can be one of the better rebounders in the league and rim protectors, which is what LSU needs. Great save by Days on the floor. That's a two. 
And it by Farm Rich, and LSU comes out with a nice crew as well. Javante Smart not listed because he will not play in this game. Garvin, one of many D1 transfers on this Colonel roster, started his college career at Charlotte. The step back for Thomas. Watch his daughter had to check in on him. <laughs> well, Coach Will Wade likes to yell anyway. He is an intense individual. Very intense and passionate. Another step back for Thomas, and he turned it to go Louisiana. I mean, he, he's a guy who I think uh, is one of those senior leaders at six feet that leads his team at all times. 11 to 80. Jones got the ball poked away. Thomas. Easy like Sunday morning. It's in Texas. Makes sense from a travel standpoint also. If you're not going to have fans, why send them all the way to the West Coast? Sure. Cam Thomas got up to a hot start Ooh, <laughs> for Nichols leading into today. They only resumed practice Christmas Eve. They had announced December 7th that they would be pausing basketball activities due to COVID-19. The junior from Lynette, Alabama now has seven. Yeah, but so does the team stop score and rebound with last year after starting all 33 games. I'm sure it's another one by Andre Just Do It Jones. Jones for the tie. Here comes Thomas. Oh. Andre Gordon off the mark. Here come the Tigers. Four on three. Trailer is Thomas, the freshman who gets his first. Still pushing. Well, you can hear Will Wade in the background. Move the ball. Move the ball. Yeah. Get it to that guy. <laughs> he is no longer. Thomas, last 10. Here's Thomas. Anything under 10. If they can get it anywhere under 10 going into the halftime locker room, that's on the defensive end. Emmanuel Miller with an over-the-back foul on the previous trip. That's his second. Here's Thomas, the freshman, step back long two. First half. Ain't imperfect, a five for five now. Thomas. Got to get on him. Save him. Point guard. And I say that um, with with all due respect because he's kind of become the point guard. He to 18. It'll be a resounding success. Just as successful as the football campaign was. Offensive board. And a slice to the hoop. But, Tom, they went a long time in this game without him getting... A tough performance, snowball into Saturday's performance. And of course, they've got Auburn at home just then. And Lewis has been guarding Watford, the point forward. He's been getting a lot of dimes to that man. Kemp! Smart, it was a game high 12. Appleby all over. The jumpers. The thing about him is when you're playing him, like if, if I'm playing him defensively right here, I'm saying, no, nah, he's not going to shoot this ball. Thomas gets a touch and a screen from Watford. And notice how they're switching that up front on the perimeter. Guys to get him to touch on the blocks. Let him go to work there, but not. Now they'll set a screen down. There's a set play for Thomas. To shoot well, look what happened at the end of the third game. Right? The sense of urgency happened with about two minutes left to play. And then they started pressing and they got tipsed up. It was perfect timing when they were coming off of uh, the way they played against Mississippi State. Oh, 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 oh. Tom Cream plays with his personnel. And having given him a week to get ready for this game, and LSU watching them play against Florida, you just had a, a feeling that... Big lead for Georgia. Bulldogs led by as many as 10. Thomas taking control. Thomas with an end one. Will Wade. Comes off the screen, right down the lane line, draws help into the chest of Garcia, finishes with contact, and expect a full court pressure again. Sets up a three and missed it. 82 to 80. Three on the way from guess who, Cam Thomas. Javante Smart. Thomas with the ball fake. Slide step three. Good. Making a simple bounce pass, fundamentals. Challenge jumper done by the camera. So you see if he breaks those out late in the game. Trigger! Trigger three! Uh -oh. Trigger! 
Texas Tech will turn you over 26% of the time. That's six best in the country. He takes a lot of shots. It's going to have to be a heave. And LSU's on the offensive glass. It leads to another one. To help McClung with the scoring load in the second half. And boy, is T.J. Shannon stepped up. LSU really needs Camp Thomas. He gets down. Shot clock at seven. Thomas gathers, fires, drives it. Star guard. So see if Mississippi State can't continue to take advantage of what could be a mismatch. Thomas. Mississippi State right now on the outside looking in, but they do have opportunities, including tonight, to pick up some. Oh, nice feed inside, but no finish there from JV and Davis. Thomas on the counter, takes it himself. And, and Corral does. Watford got it, Mac. It, it's a bit of a scramble. Thomas will try and clean it. Against LSU. Thomas nice. back on top. After they had fallen behind by seven, Cam Thomas. Oh! But, um, got to be careful. Don't cost your team. Oh, and the turnover. Nice takeaway here for LSU. LSU comes away with it. They have gone toe-to-toe -to -toe tonight with the best rebounding team in the league. Thomas at Missouri at the end of February. And all these teams have just had inconsistent play. Thor had a big shooting night in Auburn's game at Kentucky on Saturday. Hit five of six from three. Thomas, turn around. Got it. Missed the play. Just a naturally gifted score. Thomas with the rebound. Freshman out of Chesapeake, Virginia. Out of kill and he'll go to the line of the three. Defense, same thing the other way. Cam Thomas had a steam. 6'6", 210, right through Cambridge. And one. His first bucket. That ends a 13-0 LSU run. Here's Thomas going baseline. And off the window. Yeah, especially for bigs. They need to work on their legs, work on their core strength so they can move guys around in the post defensively, offensively, on the glass. That stuff comes to time in the weight room. Ooh, big play. Cam Thomas with a chance for a three-point play tonight, but they were on this possession. Leads the nation in made free throws, top five in free throws attempt. He can use his body. He plays through contact. And he hits a big piece. A burst to the rim. He's got nine now. Thomas with the answer from... Thomas, first attempt of the half. Thomas to the logo. Nearly walked. Well, when you mention those names, that's when Georgia plays well, when everybody contributes. And for Edder has been able to get a lot of minutes the last five ball games. They've been limited to almost half that in this half. Thomas changed direction. Get to See if LSU can find a sense of urgency on the offensive end. Smart to Thomas. To the elbow. Yep. Coach Martin didn't like that one, but that, that could turn out to be a big call. Drew Smith picks up a second, second one early. Watch out. Average more than 16 a game. Boy, Mark Smith got his hand caught. On, it looked like on the net on the way up. Thomas scores it. Missouri to have that rotation and stay fresh down the stretch where they're 6-1 and one now in these close games. An empty possession. Here's Thomas. These two could see each other next Friday in Nashville. Maybe round one today. For Missouri, bright future here. And three straight games of double figures before scoring just two on Wednesday. There's the total. So you can pick up an immediate win against a team that's, you know, kind of at the similar competition level as you. Thomas with a game high 19. Gets some separation. And right around the midway mark in the second half. But now LSU back ahead. Thomas with 22, sizing up Brown, puts it up, step back. All its three-point shooting efficiency this year, they have the number one adjusted defense. Oh, my, here's Jones and Watford matched up again. 
Quick double. Thomas. Jordan Bruner, the Yale transfer, missed his first three. Thomas. Good pass. Rojas from behind. It's Thomas with a block. Shackleford decides to go all the way. He missed, and here's Thomas on a run out with Teddy to defend. Thomas. I like that, Martin. It looks like Wu Wei being a real politician there, trying to get the referees on the side. I think that's real. Yeah, Thomas for teams really bubbling. Someone's going to be taking a bath. Forget about the bubble. They're going to go right in and get a bath because I'm going to tell you right now. Thomas trying to attack. Fears came. Thomas and it finally goes play by Hyatt. Starts the second half on Oshuni. Thomas on the other end. Bucket for Cam Thomas. Largest lead for the Tigers. That may be one they look at in a moment. Lofton, the frustration's coming out. Thomas, triple. Kept alive by one. Thomas attacks on Oshuni. Stops Oshuni. And one. Cam Holmes is five for 11. Thomas right past Oshuni. Thomas gets a streak screen from Days. And then takes it from deep. He's made for March. Wade will grade that out a, an A for his team and for their effort on that end of the floor. And here goes Thomas. He sees Oshuni coming, so he switches hands. He's got it all. He's entering the NCAA tournament. Three ball for Cam. Thomas is good. Certainly that's been the knock on LSU this year. We know they can score ninth in the country with 81 points per game, but they've had trouble stopping oh, people. But this guy got this. Good defense by Wagner, and now LSU will send it back out with six to shoot. Thomas in the range, Jim fires a three, Whoa. and it's good again! He's a three-point shooter, but he's shooting over some guys much taller than him, and now you see Cam Thomas has Smith on him, and he goes over him for two more. Seen rebounding with eight per game. Thomas nearly lost it. You know, LSU's kind of a different team. They're a tremendous offensive rebounding team and a very weak defensive Jeez. rebounding team. But this guy, when they out-rebound the opponent, they're 20-0. and 0. And so far tonight, it's even at 11 on the glass. Thomas left in the first half. You know who's taking this one? Thomas with five. Thomas, step back, open, and he knocks it down. Because the players listen to his voice, and he thought that was an important thing to have for the next couple of weeks as Thomas drives and scores. I can tell you, it was a heat check. Thomas straight away three. Yes! Oh.